For Mrs. Thatcher, the coal industry represented everything about the old Britain she hated. She saw it as inefficient, loss-making, and dominated by a union, the National Union of Mine Workers, that had the power to bring down governments. Worst of all, its leader, Arthur Scargill, was a Marxist who made no secret of his revolutionary beliefs. And I hope that people do regard me as a dangerous man in the respect of changing society. I'm certainly a danger and a threat to those who support the capitalist system. And I'm very proud to be a threat to the capitalist system. And I hope, by being a threat, we're able to bring about a fundamental change in society and create a new order. To him, it wasn't just a fight about pit closures, but a much bigger battle to bring down the government and usher in a new socialist era. You've only got to do one thing to win this battle, to remain united and determined. And if you do that, you'll be able to say to yourselves, with pride in your eyes, that in 1984, I stood alongside my trade union, and in doing so, was able to be part and parcel of the greatest victory in trade union history. And like her new...